hey everyone, it's Jaren9571 here, and welcome to Disclosure, I guess we're already into it, um, what about downloading something and, I don't know what's going on here, um, There's no sound, there was no menu, it just jumped right in. I don't know what's going on. Uh, this is a game by the same creators as uh, Seven Days. And we're playing that. Oh. 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 What was that? <laughs> okay. sound? I guess not. Um. Okay. I don't know the premise. I don't know what I'm doing. Controls are pretty smooth though, so that's cool. What's this? Photocopy it reads, in this specific case, mystery should be, excuse me, well crafted. However, the main character must not disclose it until the end. Hmm. Oh, I'm walking through my cupboards. All right. Dope, dope, cool. Anyways, um, yeah, uh, I, I think they were talking about the a game called Mirror Layers. Which I tried to play and could not understand. <laughs> it's a game where you have to literally um, interact with other people who have played the game because, like, outside of the game itself, because everyone experiences the game slightly differently. You all get different assets loaded into your game that you then have to, in the game, you dump an item like, at this statue altar thing. And it exports that asset into a folder that's automatically generated by the game on your computer. And then you have to go into, like, the Discord for, like, that game, the community chat, and be like, this is the asset I have, but I need this one in order to unlock, you know, this box, because, you know, you'll have a box labeled 4, but the key you get is labeled 2. And you have to swap files with other people in order to continue, and it it melted my brain. I tried to make a video, I didn't understand what was going on. I, anyways, um, I think that's what they were referencing. Um, yeah, it's, it's really dark over here. Wow, there are no lights. I can just keep going. Bye. Oh, okay, I found the wall. Is it paper? Photocopy of a book that I've lent to Sam long ago. It's an essay about the power of mystery. What is it doing here? I don't know. Do the living room. Oh. Basement? I hope I won't break my neck. Hold tight for five minutes down. Okay, it's going too fast. I can't read it. Uh, I'm going to show you that I really love these kind of things. So, I'll bet with friends, I'm going to be in the basement for five minutes. Hey, what the hell are you doing? This guy's just floating on in. You guys can't see anything. Come on, I'm a bit claustrophobic too. Move it, open the door. For the love of mystery. It's really going to stick. We have prank us. Oh, Jesus, did they just kill themselves? Wait. Um. Um. 
Okay. Uh. How the hell? Oh, the, I can stick my head through. <laughs> Guys, you okay? Hey. Why are you sleeping? Okay. Oh, I, I can go deeper. All right. Let's go deeper, I guess. That's what she said. <laughs> Sorry, that was terrible. A note written by Sam. It reads, es it Escape the room. Leave Sam's basement. Happy birthday, Tim. Okay. Let's click to think. Door is locked. What, what, was, what was that? Left click to think. I always wanted to play an escape game and reveal those two did something great this time. It's a mirror. Funny. It's like someone else is looking at me from the other side. The locker. Wooden logs? Hammer. Rubber mallet. What's this doing in a place like this? I don't know. Stump? Wooden stump for cutting wood. Stairs over here, I guess. Duct tape, rubber hammer, hemostat. Tim won't know until the end. Green thread, shotgun. If he doesn't survive this, it's useless. A bit of courage? The list of items that are hidden down here that I have to find? Is that what that is? Uh, this door is locked, okay. I'm floating, apparently. Um. Oh, coming down. <laughs> okay, this game is just a little bit broken. I'm just. Oh, there we go. Okay, it's fine. Hammer, yeah. Walker. Using the locker as a ladder, I reached the key that was hidden in the lighting fixture. Smart. Oh, I guess there was a key up there. Okay. Wait, what's over here? What's over here? What's in, oh, what's... What's... What's this? Key tied to a rope. There's a key tied to the rope. Do you want to pull it? If you die. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I um. Get 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 give me a second here. I, <laughs> I I guess apparently if you mess up and you die, um, it just exit out of the game. <laughs> I didn't know what was supposed to happen. <laughs> uh, that was a little unexpected. Okay. Um, I guess I have to go through all this again. Oh, God. Let's see. Well, I mean, they got that right. It definitely did not last five minutes down there. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. So I better not fuck up or I'm going to have to do everything all over again. Okay, okay, okay. We, 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 know, we know where to go, what to do. These guys are over here. I'm just going to follow them. Alright. Come on, just go down the stairs. Hope it won't break my neck. To pull tight for five minutes down where the wood pile is, okay? No problem. I think you'll have a big laugh, but I can assure you that I really love these kinds of things. Come on then, show us. Okay. Here we go. Chkunk. Close the door. Slit their own throats. Can I move yet? Can I move yet? There we go. Okay. 
So. Uh, I guess I can't go over there. I've read that. The door's locked. Mirror's locked. Here's the red pile. Camera, red mallet, stomp. On the locker, it moves over here. I grab a key from the lighting fixture up there. Uh, let's see, what about this door up here? I know this door up here was something. Door's locked. Um, shit. I think it broke the game. Um, there's no menu or anything. Yeah. Damn it. I have to do it all again. Uh. I have discovered something. There is actually sound in this game. You guys probably all heard it, but I couldn't because I had the volume on my headphones turned off. Jane, yes. Okay. So loud. Oh, I didn't hear this before. Oh, I like this music. Nice. Okay, let's not fall off the edge of the map this time, huh? from his grandfather. Hope he doesn't get offended if I make a few spots. I did not notice that before. Okay, well, I guess, uh... I guess that music was very short-lived. So go ahead and lock this door. But now that I have that axe... Don't pull on the rope. Do I have an inventory? Can I grab my axe out? Something beyond this? Because you die if you pull the key. But I have an axe. Can I use it? I use it on this door up here? On the wooden logs? Oh, did something. Poor mallet, what's it doing in a place like this? Okay, that did something. Ah, here we go. Use this axe to break this piece of wood. A pair of scissors stuck inside. Ah. Huh. So, let's not use this big axe to just up real quick. Let's go find a random log that has scissors stuck in it. Cut that open. Let's do we're scheming something, but I'm not that stupid. I cut the rope and got this bloody key. Yeah, okay. It's gonna be one of those games. I see. I am recording, right? Yes. Okay. 
I'm sure that hammer is going to have some use later. So now let's go straight up these stairs. Or get stuck. Eh, eh, there we go. So that key's got to go up here. Yeah. Okay. I'm in the backyard. Cool. I think. Strange. Maybe the game's atmosphere rubbed on me, but I'd swear there's a lot more signs than usual in the city. It's so peaceful. The fence is glowing. Okay, let's walk around the front, I guess. What's over here? This window? Oh, this is just... Whoa! Did I just climb through the window? The door is probably locked anyway, so... Let's go back around and discover our dead friends, shall we? Yeah, it seems like a good idea. Let's do that. Oh, God. Did they do that? Got the upper floor key from this pocket. Okay. And nothing on this side. Okay. Guess it's a good thing I went and checked their corpses. I still am not 100% on the premise of this game. But... I liked playing Seven Days. This is from the same guys, so I thought it would be fun. Okay, we are upstairs now. Sam's room. Ooh, spoopy. <sighs> Another photocopy, just like that one earlier. This one in particular talks about some mysterious cases of unexplained mass hysteria that led to death. Hmm. One of the many photocopies scattered in the house. It's the first part of an important paragraph. It talks about the importance of connective tissues and the main character to generate a mystery. Interesting. Such photocopies, maybe the wind carried them all over the house. Words highlight the screen. Rules for a scaled apocalypse. Craft the mystery and choose a main protagonist. Prepare moral danger for the protagonist. We leave this world. Suicidal hysteria. Counting on you, Tim. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. So there's some shit going on in Sam's room. To the roof. Because why not? Paper? Life is great. I wrote this. Why is it here? <laughs> oh. Let's see what's going on here. It's slowly fading. Dear Tim, since you're reading this message, it means that the whole town is already sleeping. Happy birthday. Has it really worked? Had fun in the basement? We hope so from the bottom of our hearts, just like we hope you'll reach us here to complete the circle. We've gone first because we know how much you love this town. That's why we're giving you the opportunity to perceive your beloved one alone. Just like you're the only one left in this crazy world. We love you, Tim. P.S. The blood on that key was ours. The thought that never changes remains a stupid lie. Never been quite the same No hearing, no breathing, no movement, no colors Just silence Rise and fall of shame Okay The search that shall remain
Is there more, or is this game really that short? Because if it's really that short, that's very disappointing. Okay, so... If I'm putting this together right... Your main character, you, Tim, massive fan of the horror genre, like games and movies and whatnot. Um, and your friend, Sam, has somehow created this game or this system that essentially can take over the minds of people who play the game and like cause mass hysteria make them go crazy essentially and kill themselves and you're just unraveled the mystery of it um which the whole mystery is just finding the notes. Is that really it? I, I guess that's really it. Well, I mean, the game had me, you know, into it until it just ended like that. That was what? I hadn't fucked up those couple of times I would have those what like six minutes of playtime maybe or maybe it was only five minutes maybe that was some foreshadowing there at the beginning they're talking about you won't last five minutes down there it's like if you just solve the puzzles real quick and then just walk through the house yeah, and it's like five minutes. Well, shit. Alright, well, um... I guess that's it. Uh, if you liked it, leave a like. If you feel so inclined, and if you feel the need to voice your opinions, there is a comment section down below just for that. Alright, I will uh, see you guys later.